smells incredible. I don't know why it looks like a squash bug to me, but don't be an L file. Don't be an L file. El Toria approved. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Guess who I have got? Sophia. So, um. I'm doing the splits. You're doing what? The splits. Anyway, so Sophia has joined me and Joe tonight. So we're gonna have a bit of a fun Pizza! night. Pizza! We're actually Ow. gonna put up the, what we're we gonna put up? Christmas tree! Yeah, so Ow. I thought that you can help me with that. And guess who's here? Hi. Oh! <laughs> What are you doing, madam? I hurt myself. No, you haven't. Um, I'm twisting my ankle, thank you, misters. <laughs> oh, <Love> sassy. <laughs> Uncle Jojo is teaching Sophia how to put a Christmas tree up. There you go. Good That's girl. Good. Give it a shake and a wiggle, and it all falls down. And we have to make sure all the spindles are out nicely as well. Yeah, should we do that in the last bit? We are just getting out all the Christmas decorations. Which one's your favourite so far? Is it the mermaid? No, it's the mermaid and, oh, uh, where's that snowflake? The snowflake and yeah. the mermaid. Those two are your favourites. I like those ones. They're very Oh, frosty. I like the swan now. The swan? Yeah, have you found another one? Yeah. Oh my gosh, that's a good one as well. You're crazy getting into the box like that. Another reindeer. More feathers. Shall I get you out? So step one, feather boas, but you've got to put them on really nicely. No, not on your head. So this is what my, the Christmas tree looks like first. Then we've got all these to decorate it with. Even got some ribbon. Auntie Moan's just We're there. We're just uh, doing some touches, aren't we? Do we need to put the ball on? Yeah, I think Yay! so. Yay! The best bit. So this is Nelly, the grand finale. She's just putting the star on. Are you ready? Yushka helped. <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah, the grand finale. Three, two, one. Yay! So this is the bottom. Around there. Up there. Around there. What do you think, Sophia? I think it's amazing. Yeah, you think it's really good? There's it looks lovely, doesn't it? And you better know, I'm ending the video. Sorry, honey. I'm ending the video. All right, then do you want to take? Do you want to go in the kitchen and do it? Yeah. So I hope you liked the um, video. Please subscribe, put the thumbs up, and please don't put the thumbs down. Put the notifications on, please. Bye bye. Vlog ends in five, four, three, two, one. Christmas tree is now up. So let's talk about Christmas. As Christmas is soon approaching, I know that you guys are gonna have the family at home. They're gonna be making a mess, opening presents. There's gonna be pine needles on the floor. And if you're like me, I have a pet pig and I have a dog. So I'm forever vacuuming um, straw, hair. Many of you guys may know Yuffie from their very famous RoboVac, but they actually do have a vacuum range, which is high quality and very popular in America, may I add. So here I have a brand new vacuum. This is the Eufy S11 Infinity. I am so excited to use it. It has endurance cleaning. It's got 120 AW strong suction, and it's also got dual vortex technology, so it makes it super easy to maneuver around pigs, furniture, and just everything else. It also does contain a number of attachments as well, so you have every attachment for your cleaning needs. My favorite feature is that it's cordless and it's extremely light, and I absolutely love the battery life on it. Some other vacuums that I've used previously have had really bad battery life, but this is absolutely incredible. Now, this little beauty over here is remarkable. So you can actually connect it to your Wi-Fi and you can use it with your Eufy app and also with gadgets like Alexa's. 
This honestly makes vacuuming super easy. It's lightweight, it's really quiet as well, and it has up to 100 minutes worth of go in it, so you can just like let it do its thing around the house. The strong suction is perfect for picking up pet hair and also the straw. Um, what I like to do, I actually like to leave it in the in the lounge once Milo has left and it just literally picks up everything. Um, trust me, once Milo has been in this room, he does make a bit of a mess. So having my robo back on the floor is just it's just so easy. So if you want to invest in a new vacuum for Christmas, I really, really do recommend Eufy. It comes highly recommended uh, worldwide. Um, link is down below, and you can also find a discount code from me. So we are gonna clean up some of this Mr's mess because he's left straw all over the floor, and the tree has made some mess uh, from getting all the out of the boxes, and there's dust on the floor. Um, but yeah, so let's uh, let's go do that, Miles. Shall we give it a go on your hairs? I'm gonna tap for extra suction. <laughs> Ooh. Off he goes. Yes. Look at him moving about. <laughs> right, let's unbox this. It really wouldn't be a Christmas El Toria video without doing an unboxing of an advent calendar. So today I am unboxing the Bare Minerals advent calendar. Now this one set me back £89 but the contents inside is worth £194. Now I think that this advent calendar is a mini advent calendar. I really do hope that we've got some large items in this advent calendar. So. Let's give it an open. Take the sleeve off and you open it just like a book. Day number one. First up, we have got the Bare Minerals Poreless Clay Cleanser. So this has probiotic and also super fruits inside so it's really feeds into the skin. This has prebiotics inside and also super fruits so it's super nourishing and it really feeds into the skin. Day number two. Oh my goodness, this is a tiny door. Oh, it's so cute. I think we have our first lipstick. To get the products out of this advent calendar is hard. They've used plastic, they need to not do that. First of all, we have got Courage and this is, <gasps> Something red, everyone. This is really gorgeous. I mean, the size is small, but it's not like a bad size. Day number three. It looks like we have our first eyeshadow. Oh, it isn't. This is the Bounce and Blur blush, and it's in the color Pink Sky. Wow, Pink Sky. Guy looks absolutely amazing. It's got a really nice shimmer to it. A little bit similar to Nars Orgasm, but not quite. Beautiful. Day number four. I think we got another lip product. We do. I do love a good lip product, don't I? So this lipstick is called Hibiscus, and it's a very interesting colour. It's like a, I want to say fuchsia pink, but it isn't quite fuchsia. It's a really pretty, um, kind of like a medium tone pink colour. I mean, I do like something pink. I hope we have some burgundy in here. Day number five. Something else for the face. Now this is the Skin Longevity Long Life Hub Eye Treatment. I absolutely love getting like an eye cream in the advent calendars. I just think it makes sense. Um, eye creams are really good to pop underneath the eye. It just basically injects hydration underneath and also it's very good for plumping. Plump that moisture underneath the eye. Day number six. Oh, this is, this is quite a large product. Here it looks like we've got a lip gloss and this is the Forbidden Gloss Brilliant. So the colour is really interesting. It's like a really nice, kind of like a, I want to say like a milkshake pink. This is really pretty. Day number seven. I have no idea what this is. Don't be a nail file. Don't be a nail file. For you, it isn't a nail file, but here we have got all over face color, Effet Bon Mine. So this product is amazing for giving like a nice dewy kind of bright finish to the skin. These are Gorgeous, really good if you're going out somewhere. It just gives like a lease of life to your skin. Day number eight. We have Prime Time next. So this is the eyelid primer. I really do hope that we've got some eyeshadow. 
coming up very shortly. Door number nine. Another very small lipstick. This time we have the color Honesty. Now, the shade Honesty is like a plummy color. This is definitely something I would wear every day. Door number 10. A spot of mascara by the looks of things, and this is the Strength and Length Serum Infused Mascara. So this actually helps to add strength to the lashes. So if you do have brittle dry eyelashes right now, this is something that you may need. Now the wand. It looks a little bit like a squashed wood lice. Wood louse? I uh, don't know why it looks like a squash bug to me, but interesting. It looks like it would add lift to the root of the lashes. Door number 11. We have Mineral Vow next. I used to love wearing this product on top of my Bare Minerals foundation. Now this is the original Mineral Vow. This is just like a really nice product to pop on top of any foundation. It just helps to kind of like blot away any excess oils. Um, it just this looks really pretty uh, on top of a foundation. Mineral or just a regular foundation. It also adapts to your skin tone, which is great. Door number 12, halfway through. We have another lip gloss. Oh my God, come out. <laughs> it's hurting my fingers. Okay, got it out. So this is in the color Pout. Now Pout is similar to one of the lipstick colors that were received earlier. Hang on. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty similar. So I guess if you want a gloss finish, pop this on top. Day number 13. Again, something for the skin. Now this is the original foundation primer. I've definitely used this before. It's really good if you have larger pores. My larger pores feature along here on my skin, so it's really good to pop on. Once I pop on like a um, foundation, it just makes it look a lot more flawless. Door number 14. Oh, this is a huge door. <gasps> Ooh. Nice, okay, something I've never tried before, but this is the Pureness Gel Cleanser. Now, apparently this has got coconut and prickly pear inside. Now, coconut is super nourishing for the skin. Now, personally for me, I would actually use this in combination with an electric massager, just because um, it just helps to work the gel into the skin a bit more. Smells incredible. Door number 15. Oh my goodness, we have another lip gloss and it's very similar again to the other lip gloss that we got earlier. Granted, it is lighter, but they should have given us something different. This is kind of like the same color overkill. Door number 16. This may be our first eye color. I believe it is. It's an eye color and this is in the color Celestine or Celestine should I say. Celestine is like a bronzy kind of like gold color. Like a champagne cold. El Toria approved. Day number 17. I bet the eye colors now come like buses all at once. Here we have, oh, a blush bare minerals in the color Golden Gates. I mean, we have received a blusher already. Did we need it in like mineral form? I guess it's bare minerals. Anyway, so the color of this one is definitely more of like a brownie bronze, not a brownie bronzer, a brownie bronzy kind of blusher. It definitely does have more of an earthy color to it as opposed to the other one that we got earlier. Door number 18. Oh, this is an advent calendar classic. We have seen this a lot in advent calendars and subscription boxes in the past. Now this is Skin Longevity Long Life Herb Serum. This is really beautiful underneath any moisturizer. I always find that it gives you like a new lease of life <laughs> to your skin. Um, it just sits beautifully and it's just like an extra to pop underneath your moisturizers. Door number 19. Wow, Lashtopia. Another <laughs> mascara product. So this is the Mega Volume Mineral Based Mascara. Now this is a different mascara to the one we received earlier. This is volumizing. Let's have a look. <gasps> The wand is so pretty, I cannot tell you. The wand is very similar to my favorite mascaras, which are from um, Charlotte Tilbury. They're really bushy. They look like they add loads of volume and just like body to the lash. Day number 20. This has got to be an eye color. Is it, is it, is it, is it? Up next, we have got an eye color and it's in the color Queen Phyllis. 
Now Queen Phyllis is like a light sandy gold color, like a golden sand. It is really pretty. Uh, maybe I, maybe it's more champagne, like a queen. Door number 21. Oh my goodness, now this is overkill. Oh no, why do they give us the same colors? It doesn't even want me to pick it out of the advent calendar because it's that embarrassed. So this is the color that we've received and just look, We've had three very similar colors, which makes me really sad. Day number 22. Behind this door, I think we've got our bronzer. So this is full tan, and this is all over the face color. Okay, so you can wear it all over the face, or if you're like me, you're gonna wear it as a bronzer. Day number 23. We have an eyeshadow, which isn't in mineral form. Now this is Bounce and Blur, and this is Harvest Moon. <gasps> Harvest Moon is really, truly something beautiful and gold. Wow. This is actually my favorite product so far. It just looks amazing. Door number 24, the final day. So to end the advent calendar, we do have a lipstick. Now I'm just gonna say, it would have been amazing if they would have done like a large lipstick. I mean, they've given us a mini. Anyway, nevertheless, we have a very similar color to what we received earlier. I mean, this color is beautiful. It's like that milkshake kind of like berry strawberry color. Um, I mean, I will definitely wear it every single day. It's a lovely color, but we have a lot of the same colors in this advent calendar. I mean, a lot. There we go, guys. So that is everything inside the Bare Minerals Advent Calendar for 2020. So I've just done some maths on this advent calendar. So each door works out to be three pounds 70, which to be fair for Bare Minerals, isn't actually bad at all. I know a lot of you will be put off because we've had a lot of minis inside. I mean, I, they could have given us like a large lipstick at the end, but for the price of £3.70 a door, that's not entirely bad at all. What did you make of this advent calendar? Please drop me a comment down below and let me know your thoughts. Don't forget that you can shop Eufy products. I've left everything down below, the discount code and also the link. So shop, shop, shop. But as always guys, make sure that you link, like and subscribe and I'll see you next time for another video. Bye.